Hey Collinsers, it's Chad and Declan, and today we are out on Lake Louisville, right over by our house. We've got a great video in store for you today. We're going to take our new RC boat out on the water. It can reach speeds up to uh, about 15 miles per hour. As you can see, it's uh, pretty early in the morning. It's not too uh, choppy out there on the water. It's nice and calm and cool, so we should be able to do some awesome boat tricks for you and also do a little unboxing and uh, show you the new Venom RC boat. Check it out, enjoy. Hey Declan, what are you doing? Opening this box. Cool, what's in the box? A, the boat. Awesome, show us what you got. The boat, this stick. Whoa, whoa, hold on. Show us that remote, what's it do? Is Wait, it handheld? Uh, yes. Oh, sweet. Okay, and then what's the, there's a stand, okay. Yeah, and the boat. Oh, that's awesome. So the boat can rest on the stand when you're not using it. Sweet. All right, guys. So this is the Venom Power Boat. Uh, 2.4 gigahertz high speed up to about 15 miles an hour. Disregard the 14 plus ages recommendation. Declan, how old are you? Six. All right, guys, that's going to be our little secret. I'll show you and prove to you today that a six year old can use this epically. First things first, a little bit about the boat. Now this boat has a self-correcting feature, so if it were to flip over while it's out on the water, we'll be able to use the awesome little uh, propellers right there, give it some gas full throttle, and it'll kind of rock it, and it'll flip it back over, and it will take off again. All right, Declan, you look like you're getting ready to do something. What are you about to do? Pass the boat in. All right, let's see it. Perfect, so it's upside down, so let's go ahead and correct this. All right, so we got the boat self-corrected. It was actually easier than I thought. I just had to do it, so I had to turn the camera off for a minute. But here's Declan taking it out. Going nice and slow, getting used to it. Oh yeah, whoa, check that out. Now some cool features on this, it also has trimmings like a real boat would have where you can then change how sharp of a turn it's gonna make, going left or right. And if it's choppier waters, you can control it that way too to try to keep it up upright for as long as possible. All right, Declan, give it some speed. Bring it back. Nice, that is so awesome. That is going so fast. I can hardly keep up with it, it's going so fast. All right, Declan has changed the trimmings on it, so now it's gonna be making some sharper turns. So Declan, show us what this boat can do. Got some awesome zigzags, some sharp turns. Which way is it going? I don't know. Whoa. Oh my gosh, you guys, the funniest thing just happened. I wish I was filming. I'm going to try to show you. We thought there was a bird out here and we wanted to go scare it. I'm gonna see how close I can get. There's, if you can see something sticking up out of the water right there, we took the boat over it to it to try to scare what I thought was a bird. It's kind of far away from where we are here on the dock. It turns out it's like a piece of wood or a piece of metal, something sticking straight up. And the boat nailed it straight on and flipped over and we had to rock it back up. But we kept thinking this bird was gonna fly away and then all of a sudden we heard clank. All right, so after about 10 minutes of riding this thing full throttle, it starts beeping. That means that you have one minute to get it back to you. It's a warning system, so that way you can get back and change the battery pack out. So we have a spare battery pack that came with the original boxing uh, when you purchase it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you how easy it is to switch this out. All right, Declan, come a little closer, and let's show them how we can change the battery out real quick. So it just pops into place here. You pull it up. Release the clip.
plug in your new one. Let's make sure it lines up perfect. Push this back down. Put the new battery clip back in. Now you want to make sure all your wires are tucked and under. This keeps water out of your engine compartment. Put your clip back on. Push down. Seal it. All right. We've changed the battery. We're ready to go again. All right, guys. We uh, kind of crashed it onto the boat ramp here, so we went from uh, the pier over here. I want to make sure that uh, the propeller and the trimmings aren't messed up. Okay, everything looks pretty good. All right, so if you notice right now, the remote's beeping. That is because it is out of the, the boat is actually out of the water. It's a safety feature. There's a little sensor down here at the bottom that'll beep when it's out of the water. So let's put this back in and make sure that it still goes. Declan, let her rip. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Working like a champ, okay. So here's what I thought originally was a bird earlier. Let's see if we can get a little closer here and see exactly what this is. I don't know, Collinsers, what do you think? To me, it looks like it might be a piece of wood sticking up, maybe from a tree branch. It doesn't seem too safe right here off the boat ramp. A big boat could actually come off and scrape themselves on it or puncture a hole. But uh, comment below what you think it is, and maybe I'll get in the water later and go uh, test it out to see exactly what this is. Oh, Declan's flirting with it. All right, let's see some epic moves. Zigzagging through. I bet you you're waking all the little fishies up. Ooh, that was close. All right, guys, we've got a boat coming in to dock, and then they're going to need to use the boat ramp here to get their boat back up on their truck. So we will sign off for the vlog today. Declan, how was that? Was that awesome? Yeah. All right, look at me, buddy. It's beeping because it's not in the water, that's all. All right, so what do you think about this boat? Is it super epic? Yeah. Awesome. What's the best part that it does? It builds fast. Yeah, it does. All right, guys, we're signing off on the vlog. We hope you have a great day, an awesome end to summer. Declan, what do you want to tell them? Bye.